Hello, good morning students. Welcome to the another session of your computer online class. We have completed up to chapter number four along with the question and the exercise part of the previous session uh, chapter. Today in this session we are going to start with our new chapter that is chapter number five more about a keyboard hope that everyone is fine at their home you guys are missing your school we also do so with the thought let's start with our class more about a keyboard before starting with the class a computer a computer system comprised of software and hardware hardware is the part which you can see like a computer CPU keyboard mouse printer these object or devices we can see hence these devices are hardwares now hardwares are also of different types the hardware which we use to input or to provide instructions or to type something or providing a command to the computer so the devices which are used for this purpose providing instructions command or writing something such hardware is known as input device it is very easy the devices which are used to provide input which are used to provide instructions to the computer such devices are known as your such devices are known as your input devices so we are going to learn about the main input device that is your keyboard everybody has seen, seen a keyboard and everyone knows that whatever you types on the keyboard is being shown on the screen so let's begin begin with our class today so as you can see what I am typing on the keyboard is being shown on your screen also. So I am providing input to the computer by using the in, uh, keyboard input devices. Friends, you have learned about keyboard in your previous class. In this chapter, you will learn about some special keys and how they work so what we are going to study here about we are here uh, we are going to study about the different types of key available on the keyboard okay and we will also be studying about the tux typing so now on your computer screen you can see a picture of the keyboard this is a normal keyboard looks alike the keyboard consists of seven different types of key the first type of key is number keys so as you can see the number key available here one two and it goes to up to zero so these upper one is your number keys similarly this part is your keypad number keypad it is being mostly used by the accounting purposes in accounts you require to type the amount numbers okay so for calculation and faster and easier calculation this keypad or number keypad is used 
दिस इज योर नंबर की लाइन दिस इज द फर्स्ट पार्ट ऑफ योर की बोर्ड आफ्टर दैट द सेकेंड इज योर बैक स्पेस की विच इज अवेलेबल हेयर other that third is your delete key which is available here now what is the difference between a backspace key and a delete key backspace key deletes the character towards the left side like here if i am using the backspace key it is deleting towards the left side left side ki taraf delete hote ja rahe hain characters whereas if i am writing anything if i write something on or sorry type on something and if i am using the delete key so you can see delete key is deleting the characters towards the right side so this is the basic difference between backspace key and delete key backspace key deletes towards left it deletes towards the left side delete key deletes towards the right side the fourth is your alphabetic keys which is from a to z it's not being Uh, arranged in the particular order but rather than for speed up your typing to speed up your typing the keys are arranged in the available or mentioned manner so these are not in the proper uh, sequence but they are arranged in such a manner that your typing should become easier and faster by using your fingers then the longest button of your keyboard which is the space bar key which gives you or which allows you to leave a space between two given letters or words the enter key which finally enters the uh, command or it is used to shift to the new line while we are typing when we are typing and we want to shift to the new line you can click on it and the seventh is your arrow key which is used for your navigation purpose for navigating from one point to another in the document so this is your overall beginning of the topic keyboard a keyboard is a part of a computer it has buttons called keys some of the important keys on a keyboard are followed 